look always intimidates me a little. That yeah, a little bit, just a little. Did you guys have any any uh, interaction or feelings about about Ebert as performers, as people who have been in films? No, uh, this is a, again one of those things. The uh, uh, I've never made a film, uh, and yet I'm mad that he didn't review it. <laughs> <laughs> You were you were in the in the, the Woody Allen film. The yeah, no, but I mean, I myself you, know, you haven't made the film. You haven't right. Mm -hmm. You 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 recently posted on Facebook, I believe, that all your ideas for TV shows are shows that appeal to people who don't watch TV or purchase television. Yes. <laughs> yeah, which which gets in the way. Mm -hmm. Guaranteed a failure. Yeah, I just uh, <clears throat> I just feel so gratified that Mr. Ebert was such an enormous fan of of my of me. <laughs> That he seemed to pick me out in uh, everything I ever did. Well, you were you were in the uh, the Oz movie, the not the original, but the the new one. Yeah, and the original. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they He's reprised grown. my they reprised my role. <laughs> what? Uh, hey, did that kid of yours figure out that we don't take suggestions? What was all that about? <laughs> <laughs> what do you, what do you guys think of all that 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 uh, those games that those games when you're doing improv and they're like doing that shit with the games? It's uh, it's all I think it serves a purpose. That, you know, like in the middle of a review show, they do that a lot, and I think that's a good. I think there, there's, it's all fine, just yeah. not not all that interesting to me. Yeah, w is it because w you don't care what other other people think, or or? Well, there's that's partly that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's uh, like the luge. You know, like it's. It is like the luge. I'm glad that it exists. I just don't want to do it. You know? <laughs> the skeleton, however, <laughs> and not in a snobby way. It's just not as satisfying. Yeah, I and don't it's think it's really you... hard too. Yeah, it's really hard. The you luge. Know, I... Yeah. 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 Short form luge. Specifically. <laughs> or you take really, suggestions. Really hard. Uh, and I think it's yeah. Part of that is like you. It, yeah, to get good at something, you have to kind of focus on that. So. Um, I think that's the the goal is to just do the one thing. I'm sorry. This is that's fine. That's fine. Do, do, just how are you? Are you a loud drinker or when you when you drink the water? We're gonna find out. Let's do it. Uh, so you guys are good at the at the at the. You, I think that was that was quieter than most. I don't think anybody even saw it. <laughs> You guys are good at the at the at the at the quiet moments, whereas I'm more of that guy who's like, blah, 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 blah. somebody's not talking, I've got to talk. How do you how do you keep those those in the show? I saw there were spaces. In fact, the first I think t 20 minutes of the show was just you guys looking at each other. And yeah, the the nice way to put it is that there's those quiet moments. We re <laughs> we, we refer to them as the uh, the times of confusion. <laughs> 20 minutes. 20 minutes of no talk? No, no. It was it was, it just seemed it like seemed, that. It did. Yeah. It seemed like an eternity. <laughs> what was going on there? It was it was good. People were laughing and, and what just, was going on there was a, there was a there was a there was a, an exchange occurring. No, I know it? that. I know that. But but um, and it I, and I, it was a, to me it was a very deep exchange and I just wanted your thoughts on how deep it was. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> It was the Marianas Trench. Yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. Challenger Deep. Between Halfway the Marianas Trench and Challenger Deep. <laughs> the, this is a, seri a serious question, but you can, you can take it anywhere you'd like. Uh, do you remember the show on Wednesday, or, or is it just completely out of your mind, gone forever? Yeah, I remember it. <clears throat> yeah, I remember it pretty well. With prompting, I'd remember more of it. Yeah. Once we, yeah. Do but you like when you were talking about it, it sounded like... Like a shit storm. Yeah. <laughs> We're also planning on doing it again next Wednesday, so so don't blow it. We'll we'll get good at it by then. Well, you you went off, and I remember you you said stick around afterward, Mark, and and we'll come out and 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 you can tell us that it was good, and and then we. Stayed backstage for, for half an hour, and you were still out there. I, well, I, and and I just you know I was I was I was doing things. I was busy <laughs> with some things. Um, but but what do you, what were you talking about? What what happens back there? Well, we kind of just go over the show from the very beginning and try to figure out. Uh, it seemed like you just did the show again back there. It was. It was <laughs> oh, that it took that long? Yeah, yeah. We're really slow talkers. <laughs> <laughs> what seriously? What you so you go over it and? Yeah, we try and figure out what we what we screwed up, what we could have what we could have done better, um, uh, or how David messed it up, <laughs> what David could have done better. <laughs> uh, yeah, that that kind of that kind of stuff. 
D if we missed anything, any cues or something like that, hey, was that right that you were that guy when you came back and just that kind of conversation. And then I do some online banking. Just quiet. <laughs> he can it's take my a time. He can take a picture of his check. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a wonderful world we live in. <laughs> Are they attractive looking checks that would make a nice, nice Mike's photo? You yeah. Get oh, copies. Yeah. Oh, you mean people from Czechoslovakia? <laughs> <laughs> you know, uh, you, you, you've, I, I've heard, uh, and you guys might know something about it, having done some commercial work, that, that instead of hiring people like you, they just now go to the Czech Republic because they look like you in the Czech They look like any American. Th this is true, that, that if you need people to look like Americans, you can get every single American in the Czech Republic. For, for half the price. So that's why we're not working. Mm -hmm. And also, it would be difficult It would be difficult to pay someone half of what we get paid. <laughs> <laughs> so they go to the, they go to the they Czech, to, Czech Republic. Yeah, the flight probably costs. <laughs> <laughs> they go to the Czech Republic for Americans, just like they go to Toronto for Chicago. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's right. Um, when the, but they just they, they film the movies in Toronto, but they don't use Canadians, do they? I mean, they wouldn't they wouldn't stoop that low. <laughs> we can sure tell. Yeah. Uh, one thing I, I was curious about is is I'm going to phrase this wrong, not why you do the show and you've been doing it a long time, but but what happens when you're you're up there w that you don't get. Or what are you thinking about? Or what's the experience like that you can't get anywhere else in in life? Well, my, I, absolutely, my brain works differently doing that than at any other time, and I cannot uh, artificially uh, produce that. And uh, I wish I could, but uh, for some reason, I don't know if it's the you know that there's people out there, and that and there's a little bit of you know uh, fear about, well, you know, we could just eat it. Um, and uh, so the, things are different. Things, it's a different state of mind for me. And, and uh, so this works differently because I, uh, that situation is unique to that uh, uh, setting. So I, that's what I enjoy about it. And then is that a f like a freeing feeling? Yeah, it's really fun. It's really fun. Like, oh, this, you know, uh, under pressure or, you know, in that situation, this thing does things that it normally doesn't do, and I enjoy watching that. Yeah, it, it, <clears throat> it feels like life, but better than, <laughs> than life, and, you know. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you get to mouth up at the cop. <laughs> <laughs> and you're, you're, you're heightened. Uh, a lot of it feels like, I don't know if anyone, you know, like, if you played, like, Chase when you were a kid, and you're in the woods, and, and your senses are so, you feel like you can hear bugs and you know and like you're just like you know really sens sensorily sensually alive at that moment if you ever want to stop doing that but still hear hear the bugs get go to a doctor and get the wax taken out of your ear it's the actually the same <laughs> scenario you hear the ants crawling on the ground hey little buddy so just a little tip for you will do yeah, uh, that derailed the conversation a little bit, but I'm going to get back on, and that's... The you look awake. Do I? Yeah. Well, I'm up here. I'm, I'm feeling what, what, what you're feeling. Oh, you know, it feels like, like life, only a, a little worse. <laughs> uh, <laughs> do, <laughs> mo moment, moment. Sure, let's Should give it a shot. Little moment. All right, I'm think, uh, thinking, uh, uh, can you guys shout out a state? Anybody shout out a state? Wisconsin. There we go. Um, have you guys ever been to Wisconsin? Together? Yeah. Have we been there together? Uh, no. No, we've not been to Wisconsin together. Do you guys do things together apart from the show? Not a lot. <laughs> not a lot. No, Dave would say after the first year of doing the show that we had spent 52 hours of I've known Time him for together. exactly 52 hours. <laughs> <laughs> we do a show once a week that lasts an hour. Yeah. But oh, then that, there's that's, like, a, that's an important part too. Yeah. 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 That was it. Yeah. Do you do you, when that's different now? We we you know because we travel together and stuff like yeah. that. Well, you've been have you been doing more of that? 
Well, not more necessarily. We do a, we do a fair amount. We used to do a, a lot when we went to New York. We used to go to New York every month, and now we only go there about four or five times a year. We've also recently just created a detective agency, and we only solve sexy crimes. <laughs> <laughs> but they all are. So we're going to be spending more time together. We got a pretty broad Hopefully. definition of sexy. Yeah. Well, As we all should. I mean, I mean... <laughs> Do you, do you do you share do you share things about about your lives? Are there common frames of reference, or do you come to that hour uh, basically with with different points of view, different references, different everything, and then hopefully find common ground within that hour? Uh, well, I think just we're we're pretty different <clears throat> people, and so we do have different references and different ways of looking at that looking at things, I imagine. But that uh, we don't worry about <clears throat> them having become common ground because discussing those differences is, is sustainable in, its, in itself. That probably us not being of too like a mind to each other is of more use than if we felt uh, too similarly about And one of the ways that we're different is I think we're exactly the same. <laughs> <laughs> Do you, do you, when you're up there, this is, are you relaxed or are you, to me, here's, let me, let me ask you if this is correct. The way it seems to me is that you are somehow both relaxed and intense at the same time. I think that's probably pretty accurate. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> up until the point the, the show starts, I have sort of a, a ferret-like panic going <laughs> usually. <laughs> And then once the show begins, there, there, it, there doesn't seem to be as much room to be scared anymore. So often it just kind of gets quiet at that point. So yeah, it's much the more rest relaxed. of kind of the rest of everything goes away. That's one of the things that's nice about that time. Also, everything else goes away. You're not worried about you know your bank balance and stuff like that. Everything does just go away, and all that's there is just this stuff. First of all, it's just him, and then it's me, and then it's the stuff we create. But nothing else outside of that really is able to filter in because you're kind of paying, paying pretty close attention to what's going on up here. Why, why do you do it so, so late? Is, is, I don't mean that as a joke. <laughs> is, there, is there a reason that that, that is it that you have other things to do earlier in the day? We just didn't want to interfere. Initially, we just didn't want to interfere with their regular show schedule, and so we asked for a time that was that was open. And, and, um, and now, with it being 11 o'clock on a Wednesday, you can kind of be sure that if someone gets their ass to that place at that time, then they really kind of want to be there. You know, like, <laughs> yeah. Uh, every time I've been there, every time, uh, which is twice. Um, <laughs> There, there has but one hundred percent of those times, every single one of those of those two, which yeah, well, that would be one hundred percent. We, we've, uh, I've sat next to people who have been talking passionately about about you guys, and obviously the crowd is a very loving, supportive crowd. And and one of the things that the person, unlike this hostile mess, <laughs> they these people. <laughs> And I've been doing it for five years, are some of the biggest <laughs> pieces uh, no, uh, of love. They, they, they said, the woman said to her friend, who I think was there for the first time, she said, TJ and Dave would, would die for one another. W is, true? True? <laughs> yes. What? Yes. True. Yes. True. I suspect he would die for me. <laughs> a lot of shit to do. What? No, I would. Uh, but to be fair, I would. But I would die. I would just. I would love to die. <laughs> nothing special about him. <laughs> Is there anybody in this crowd you wouldn't die for? No. 